Hi everyone, this is Deep Single from Attack Point. So welcome back to the episode of Hackintosh on Lenovo Y50. This is the part third of the series and in this tutorial I will going to show how to install Clover into your hard drive and how you will be independent from your pen drive to boot your Yosemite again and again. First boot up in your Windows PC and go to search and search for CMD and once you see the command prompt icon you just need to right click on it and run it as an administrator you will see such window in that window you have to uh, type disk part and after that you will need to type select disk 0 and then you need to type select partition 2 after that you will need to type assign letter is equal to B and then exit after that type in task slash f slash i am explore per dot exe then again explorer dot exe this pretty much a uh, command will going to mount your uh, boot drive in which your all boot managers and everything loaded up let me show you it is as you can see the system drive thing come up over here in which there is boot and if we file kind of stuff so now you will need to go to your pen drive as you can see this is my pen drive here's the if folder for it right this is the system drive hard drive in which there are boot records in which there are boot records saved so there is an ify folder you need to drag your clover thing into this ify folder once you're done with this your hard drive will save your boot records and you will get all these things inside After that you will need one software which is called Easy UEFI. You will find this on this website easyuefi.com and download the app. This is free application. After you download install it, it is a very simple process. Then you will just need to go to UEFI this software. Then just tap on this button they create a new entry in this you will need to select the type of this Linux and in this you name it as OSX after that you need to select a boot partition which is this one and then browse the file like this in this you need to select lower x64 dot EFI After that click OK and hit OK once again. As you can see it is listing in the last so you just need to move it up. After that you will be able to boot Clover UEFI menu from your hard drive directly instead of a pen drive. Just to test it out you just need to restart your PC by hitting this button
after that you will get a clover boot menu which is directly booting from your hard drive there is no pen drive connected anymore and you will just need to select your sx drive which is in this video is yosemite then as in part 2 i showed so just click on it and it will going to boot up So you're getting this screen as as in shown in part two that you have to just press the combination of sleep button which is Fn plus F1 and then hit spacebar you will get the screen right back uh, without any problem and as you can see this is Yosemite running on Lenovo Y50 and booted directly from your hard drive instead of pen drive right now and this video is pretty much about it. In the next couple of videos, I will going to focus on hardcore method of how to patch DSDTs and how to extract them. Those tutorial will going to need uh, running Hackintosh on your uh, Lenovo Y50. So till that time, just set it up your Lenovo Y50 to this stage and let me know in the comment. This is pretty much about it. Thanks for watching. And in the next uh, episode, I will going to cover all the drivers patching stuff, uh, including extracting DSDTs and SSDTs from Linux. And so this will require a running Hackintosh under Lenovo Y50 till this stage, uh, which I just showed. So this is all, guys. Thanks for watching. This is Deep Singer from Attack Point.